Hey, what's up, guys? This is Wardy Geek. Welcome back to some more Let's Play Jet Set Radio Future. Time to head off to face the Immortals, who, uh, yeah. Okay, let me rephrase that. We're going to go find the Immortals so they can give us some information on Yo-Yo's disappearing act, as Kay called it, from last episode, or last chapter in this case. So, to get to where the Immortals are, we have to go on 99th Street, and then instead of taking a left over up here, just keep going forward. And then you'll reach the Skyscraper District and Faro Park. Uh, not really much else to say, but it's pretty simple. There are a few areas that are intertwined or connected like this. Uh, I think in specific order, the garage, 99th Street, uh, skyscraper district. This right here is a skyscraper district in Pharaoh Park, an open air garden built by some rich Egyptian dude living in Tokyo, and the holy sanctuary of the immortals. Do me a favor, give the immortals nasty graffiti a facelift. And thanks, K, for interrupting me. Uh, okay, 99th Street. Uh, skyscraper District and Highway Zero. Those are the um, those are the places that are connect. Get off of me! Get the stop. Hey yo. So yeah, we're playing as Garum. I haven't really played as Garum all that off all that much, so I can't really give any tips on how to play as him when it, as opposed to any other character. Uh, he does seem a little too exotic with his his airs. So that, I guess that could be a little distracting. It is for me anyway. Um what do? Don't get on the ground. And you stop trying to fly into the electric fence. Hi guys. Well, he ran into the the fence. Come at me. Up up up. Uh -huh. Wow. I didn't mean to grind. Did I get both of them or Oh no. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kill them all. And now Hayashi. Hayashi is, if you haven't noticed, Hayashi just gets crazier and crazier every encounter that you have with him. And by the end of it all, he's a, he's batshit insane. So yeah, Hayashi, crazy guy. Probably one of my favorite characters, though, just to how lunatic he is, or how much of one he is, anyway. Because lunatic is an adjective and a noun now, isn't it? No, I'm just being stupid. All right, welcome to Pharaoh Park. Over oh, here's the uh, save. Da -da -da. There we go. And as you can see here, this is what the skyscraper district looks like. It's very, uh... It's big. I'll give it that much. It used to be one of my f least favorite as well. Um, well, it used to be my least favorite, but... No, wait, what am I talking about? It still is. I, I might be thinking of, um... The sewers, the underground sewage facility, where uh, that used to be my least favorite, but then this came along, and I was like, "Oh wait, no, this is worse than the sewers." So yeah, this is one of my least favorite uh, areas, just because of a part we'll get to a little later. As we can see here, here are the immortals, but we can't actually trigger them. Is the immortal sleeping in their coffin, or what? Is the immortal sleeping in the coffin, or what? Go and conquer Hikage Street, Kibogawka Hill, and the Skyscraper District while those mummies are sleeping. 
All right, so now we just got to tag all their graffiti that they've left before they went into their almost eternal slumber. We can start right here in the in the uh, skyscraper skyscraper district slash Pharaoh Park. This is the Pharaoh Park itself. We'll get to the skyscrapers a little later. Over here, I think that's all we needed to really do on uh, this side. I don't know if there are any other tagging spots in this general area. Uh, nope, doesn't look like there's anything over here. So, I actually, I think that's it for Pharaoh Park. I could just... Hold on. <coughs> What? Ah. Anything down here? This is another area we can come to um, to get a graffiti soul once we unlock the uh, the challenge or the mystery tape, rather. Woo wee! All right, let's go to the skyscraper district. We gotta go up this uh, pillar to go to one of them. Or one of them, one of the areas of the skyscraper district, skyscrapers. Now here's why. Here's one of the reasons why I hate this uh, level, because you have these tricky jumps to do that all, and you're always put on ramps like this that will boost your speed uh, when you're going up them. I mean, sure, they're practical and fun to do, but also at the same time, if you don't time them right, you're going to be sent flying into a wall and prevent your. Uh, Prevent. What am I trying to say here? You can't get any farther if you do mess up. You just have to start back from where you failed and do it again. This is one of the reasons why I don't like this stage. Another reason is uh, that these are scattered all over the place. So, it, and if you want to look at the map, it's almost no help because it's pretty disorienting as to where you're supposed to go for each little graffiti spot. Thankfully, there are only 16, and we already got half of them done, so... Uh, I guess we don't really need to worry about much. Hopefully, I don't screw up majorly at one point. I might do it intentionally later on, because, uh... Getting back to the start from this area is pretty... non-linear. Uh, bu -bu -bu -bu. Yeah, also these precise jumps, if you can't actually see them, ugh. and there's one of my first fails, one of my first, I can't talk today, it is my first. Uh, these precise jumps, if you can't pinpoint where you're gonna uh, start your jump and then end your jump, it's it can screw you up, mate. I, I just keep wanting to say majorly for some reason, but it is gonna screw you up a lot. Okay, I messed up another jump there, so let's jump back here. See, this is what I mean. If you mess up one of your jumps, you have to back, you have to backtrack and then try it again. There's another graffiti bit later on that we, uh, I think we just have to do for extra uh, content. Like it's not required of the storyline to do. That will require a lot more uh, dedication in the stage to traversing the area. I don't, is there one up here? I don't even know. I think this is just this is something for later. Uh, yep, so this is another place to come, so I wasted my time. Should have checked. Um, next one is, or next closest one is just back this way, but uh, to the right a little. Yeah, it's a few buildings over. Cheese it. Alrighty. Uh, a little further over. And yoink! And then you got these satellite dishes. That one in particular always screws me up because it, you're uh, going into it. Into the... Uh, what's it called? Into the lower part. So you have to time your your jump at the uh, at the right moment. Okay, I can't I can't focus today. So if my commentary is really lacking, that's why I just can't focus. Um. Anyway, what was I just saying? See, there I go again. My train of thoughts just all over the place. 
It's just a graffiti soul that way, so we don't need to go there. Um, let's head over here to get the next graffiti. Or, to tag the next area. Right down here. Thankfully, some of these are pretty easy to uh, tag. Or get to, for that matter. Shit! Never mind. Thankfully, this one spawns me all the way back here, so... Uh, did I say thankfully? There's still one over there we need to get. Shouldn't have started backtracking right away. Yeah, that's what I was talking about with the satellite dish. If you don't time your jump just right when you're going down into it, you can end up flying off of it. Which gets really annoying. Especially when you're trying to go back and forth between the places. Although, one thing I do like about this stage is how when you're going across these billboards on the skyscrapers, it's pretty uh, interesting to see the, like, these, uh, what are they, I think they're teenagers, uh, just going on rollerblades across skyscrapers and grinding on billboards over, like, death pits, and they are able to, well, aside from Garum, who just wants to hug the, uh, the skyscrapers. Uh, yeah. Okay. Really? And Garam can also apparently fall through skyscrapers. Thankfully, you only just take minimal damage when you fall off the, uh, the scrapers. So, yeah. They don't kill you, thankfully. If they did kill you, I would have to sue a bitch, but... It's a good thing they're not that dickish. Okay, uh... 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 Ah, uh, god! Uh, ah, son of a... Seriously? Well, I landed back in Pharaoh Park for some reason. Time to go back. Time to go back. 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 It's devolved into that now, where I'm just making noise to replace my commentary. Because this, as I said, is my least favorite area. Actually, now that I think about it, I don't think we need to... Actually, yes, we do, but... I want to see... Seriously. Garam, you're not making this easy for me. And I'm moving around a little bit, so if you heard a bit of shuffling there, that was me. Just moving. God! Need more speed! Okay, you, go. And go. And now try this area. This leads you to a different part of the skyscrapers. Um, that is... The, and you can't access the other, uh part of the skyscraper district through this. At least I don't think. Not easily, anyway. Uh, you could vice versa, I believe. But I'm not sure. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Two more. And they're over there. So, backtrack a little. Maybe not that way. Great, now I have to take the long way. My foot is falling asleep. That is great. Oh, shoot. I had a feeling. Ah. Pit. Sayonara! Sayonara. That's Japanese for sayonara. Alright, let's do this again. Because this is pissing me off. I can't even... Mimic or mock for that matter, Garum. That's just how funky he is. And then again, he is easily impressed, so he might be borrowing some of the terminology used by those who impressed him. Which apparently was a little kid. I don't know. Okay. Uh boom boom. There we go, graffiti done. Uh, 
Alright, now, commit suicide so we can get back to, uh, that wasn't where I wanted to go. Uh, huh. Did K say we gotta go? Kibo Galka Hill and um, Hikage Street. That's right. Oh god, Hikage Street. That's just annoying as well. But I guess we can tackle Kibo Galka Hill next. No, Kibo Galka is the one I'm thinking of that's annoying. Eesh. I can't go to Highway Zero yet, so we gotta just head back to the garage. And I'll show you how to get to. Uh, Actually, hmm, what should we tackle next? I want to say Kibogalka Hill just so we can get the worst one out of the way, because, um, Hikage Street's all, not all that bad, it's just tedious. Um, I guess I'll save the worst, in this case, for last, so let's go to Hikage Street. To get to Hikage Street, all we gotta do is go to Shibuya Terminal. And where and where we would go to? No, what am I trying to say? There are six exits of Shibuya Terminal. One goes to the garage, I believe. One goes to Dogenzaka. Two go to Chuo Street, and one goes to um. One goes to Akage. Did I say six? I meant five. Um. Wait, this is Dogenzaka, isn't it? No. Yeah. Uh, Hikage Street is just this way. Oh, thanks, K. You better go check the street. Did he say out? I didn't even know. So yeah, Poison Jam did go down to Hikage Street, uh, when I pointed it out. Just the other day, the love shockers of Hikage Street were mixing it up with the noise tanks new toadies, the Immortals. Let's go do something about all that ugly immortal graffiti. I'm not sure I want to be Garum. Hiccup. I'm not sure I want to be Garum here. So let's switch characters back to my favorite. You know, for no reason. I just like B. He's stylish. He's cool. He's all of the above. I don't know. I just like him. He's, he was also featured in two Sega crossover games. Uh, that being uh, All Stars Racing, and All Stars Racing Transform for that matter, and uh, Sega Superstars Tennis. I've only played one of those. But Beat is still pretty awesome. Just a straight line down here. <laughs> oh, God! I didn't even read those, but then I found that hilarious, so. So he actually bitch slapped somebody. That was interesting. Uh, here we go. Uh, yeah, there are how many here? Four in this general area. There's two up there. Ah. Damn my god dang it. Get on the ground. I don't care if your pants are on the ground. Just get on the ground. Hey, you. <laughs> okay, come on. They only require two, so we're good there. Quickly, get these quickly. Eh, ah, only got two of them. Doesn't matter. Alright, this is a little tedious, but I'm just gonna take the shortcuts. But, it's not that bad once you know it. And by once you know it, I mean... It's straightforward, but there are a couple shortcuts you can do. Like this one. Normally you just have to go around in a circle, but I exploited that. Can't jump there. You have to jump here. And then... Okay, okay, okay. Uh, one on the other side. Oop. Oop. Is it right here? Or can we even access it? Oop. Uh, uh, 
birthday cake's playing, I'm gonna try not to listen to it. Let's see. D uh oh. Damn it! Okay, now I gotta go around the other. The, uh, the long way. Wait, is, this, is the tape back here? I know it's behind one of these. Nope. This one, maybe? Nope. That one, maybe? Nope. Apparently, all of them contain Chuck Testa. Chuck Testicles. As soon as I said that, I was reminded of um, Bobby Hill in, uh, in King of the Hill. Or at least the only reason I know of that scene is because of Durham Rocker Z. Is that Majigger? Uh, and his YouTube poop of. Uh, That's my purse! I don't know you! And a testicle shot. I kicked him as hard as I could in his testicles. What testicles? What testicles? And then I lost every single viewer on the video. True story. Uh, why am I going over here? I already got all of them. St beat! I swear to God. And it's another annoying uh, thing about Hikage Street is how you... <sighs> the rails get in the way. As hard as, as hard as that... As hard as that is to believe, they actually do. Oh, there's the tape. Gimme. Uh, bu 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 bu. Uh, bu bu uh, bu bu. Oh, I was going the wrong way. I'm still. Do 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 do. Don't mind me. Uh, what a use stupidity in full force. Just you know, normal. Do 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 do. Did the song glitch? Well, thankfully, I don't have to hear it anymore, but I might as well just insert something. Is it playing? I can't even hear it. Okay, I might as well just add something in here if it isn't. Uh, there's some spray cans back here. Yep. 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 A good, uh, a good thing to note about the paths you have to take in Hikage Street without having to constantly look at your map, is if you see these, you're going the right way. Take it right here. Nope. Next one. Nope, there isn't one. I'm stupid. Then again, what's new? Oh. New music. I guess I didn't have to put anything in, but if I did, it's probably something short. Oh. Sweet soul, brother. Yeah, that I can hear. Hi, hi, get on the ground. It, oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Damn it. Okay, uh, gonna need to hit both of them with this. And the next one over there. There we go. <laughs> uh, never mind. I kicked him, apparently. Kicked him with my skates. Alright. Um, we can take the shortcut if we want to, which is... We Oh, well, that works too. So now we're all the way at the top already. Uh, there's a lot to get done over here. Uh, there's one over here. Spray that. Ooh, there's one up there. I can see it. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going the Oh, son of a... <sighs> right at the bottom. Way to go. Another annoying thing is when the rails don't cooperate. Because rails are known to do that. They're known to uh, not cooperate with you. Even in real life. It's a metaphor. Um, <clears throat> yeah. It's kind of annoying. Where if you don't want them to, or your character to lock onto them, they do. And when you do want them to lock on, they don't. And then you fall. Like that. See? And now I got hurt. God damn it. Beat! Swear to God. Oh, that reminds me. I've been reading a lot of the Sonic comics recently, and by a lot of them, I mean all of the available free ones on the App Store, uh, or on the app for the iPhone, and the ones I uh, bought in there, which was the most recent Sonic Universe, uh, the All Stars Racing Transform, uh, Sonic and All Stars Racing Transform promo, I guess. And a couple of the new Sonic uh, regulars. 
So, uh, yeah. I did like the, uh, the promo one for All-Star Vision Transform, just because Beat was in it. Like, he was featured in it, I, I was featured in it, Danica Patrick, or whatever her name was, is also in it. Also, Vice from, um, I forgot the name of the game, but he's of the blue... Blue something. Sonic made a remark on that when Vice asked him to, uh, made a offer for Sonic to join. And Sonic said, I got the color down, don't I? Blue Rogues, that's the name of it. Um... Yeah, I enjoyed it. Uh, I enjoyed that issue. Uh, oh, birthday cake. I was wondering why that sounded familiar. You're gonna do it. Okay, guess what? <laughs> that woman was walking. Not, she wasn't even walking, she was just hovering. Hovering on the ground, yeah, me and their language. And, uh, is this where we gotta, yep. Oh, that graffiti soul's in a dick place. Dick place, because that, that can happen. I can't actually get it from here because I don't have enough spray cans. I would do a boost dash, but no boost. Uh, I don't have enough, I'm short of one can. Uh, this isn't the right way. This is the right way. It's the Rokaku Police Special Terror Drill. Looks like they're here to clean up all the garbage in the streets. Watch your back. Make sure you don't get taken out of the trash. Unload that beautiful paint of yours on those lifeless machines. Oh god, this thing. Alright, so now we gotta grind up and fight a boss. And even then, it's not that difficult. Sure, it's tedious and annoying with birthday cake playing, but eh, couldn't be simpler. Just get up to it and tag it. But do watch out for those rockets, because they do hurt. Uh, where is his leg? Oh, it's up there. Do 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 do. Is that one? Nope. Come on, buddy. Yeet! Ah, oh, son of a... I don't mess that one up. Just fucking everything up! Yikes. Okay. That was almost bad. Okay, where are you? Aha. Uh -huh. Lock on to it. Thank you. And then... Aha. Uh -huh. No! That was beautiful, B. Beautiful. Get up there! It really doesn't help the birthday cake play. <sighs> There's one thing that could probably be no more annoying than this song is when you're trying to do work at night, or when I'm trying to do work at night, in my room, and my roommate's already knocked out, and the time is only 9 o'clock. Why would that be annoying, you ask? That guy can snore louder than a chainsaw if the chainsaw was right next to your ear. Keep in mind, he's he's a, he's entirely across the room from me, and I can hear him, like, I don't know, it's just really stupidly loud. I think Secret Fairy or Shally can back me up on this. Maybe Bonsai Basher. Um, Mega Pie Man, I'm not sure about. Majorai, no, because I haven't really been in a call with him, so he wouldn't know. Captain, uh, adjustments are still being made. We don't know how stable it is. Shut up and stay out of my way. If I say it's okay, then it's okay. Got it? Up, 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 up. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I don't want to go. I don't. No, the beat. I don't want to do this. Beat. Stop. No, no. Stop locking on. I swear to God. Because you're going the wrong way. Thank you. I say this boss isn't that bad, and it really isn't. It's just getting to him and around him and navigating the rails. It's just bombs. We. Ah, oh, God. Herb! Yeah, for getting off the rails, you don't want to hold down and. Ow! Jesus. You don't want to hold down 
when you're, um, when you're trying to get off the damn it, when you're trying to get off of it, you're, you have to just jump normally and then navigate. You can't hold any direction, otherwise you're, uh, gonna fly in that direction once you jump. Where normally, if you're on the ground, you can navigate only slightly in the air. If you do it in, on the rails, uh, if you just jump normally, you go straight up in the air, and then you can navigate a little bit in that, like, while you're in the air there. But then if you tap a direction and while you're on a, a rail and then jump, then you go flying in that direction. That can be a, a, a real annoyance in this stage because, uh, or this level rather, because if you, with these tight cord, I guess you can't really call them quarters, uh, if you, if you jump in this general area, be, please spray him. Why are you not spraying him? Oh my god. Like, here's what I mean. I just jumped right there and I was able to make it, but if I did this, I would just jump to the next rail. I was holding uh, left there, by the way. Oh, come on. See what I mean about tedious? If you can't make it. Come on, where the hell? Beat, stop it, I swear. No! Uh -huh. Where the. How? Okay. Ha 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 Oh, great. Even better. Uh, time to tag the rest of the graffiti, I guess. Uh, I've been recording for half an hour. That's not good. Gotta wrap it up right after this. Oh, shoot! No! No! Bad! Bad! Well, I fell down. I'd love to get this. Yeah, I'm on. Okay. And stop running into the wall. Beat you and your ar arithmetic, arithmetic, ar ar aristocracy. I don't even know what that word means. Come on. Speed up. Gotta go faster. <sighs> I don't know what to say. Except for check out that style, I guess. But even then. Shit! No! No! Bad! Bad! No! Son of a! God damn it! Oh, damn it. <sighs> I need more spray cans. First world problems, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, gentlemen. Because there exists no women on the internet. Come on, beat. I'm not in the mood. Oh, I've never heard this song before, or rather never, I should say, I've rarely heard this song. Because in post-game this doesn't play. There are, I think, five or six songs that actually play during the end-game, uh, well, after-game. Because, actually I don't know why, but there are just a, there's just a select few of the available songs in the game that play only, um... And by play only during the after game, or whatever you want to call it, I mean, it. they don't... <clears throat> How 
How do I want to phrase this? Phrase this. Um, there are five or six songs that play for the after game, and no other songs play during the after game other than those. So yeah, that was hell. Uh, I'm pretty sure he, none of you stick, stuck through the entire 30 minutes of this. Uh, I guess I'll cut it here, just to avoid me going insane. I don't know what to say. Uh, bye.